Hey everyone, and welcome to episode 3 of my ex Undead Forestry Spotlight, where I build the flowchart of forestry. Um, right now I'm taking a bird eye's view. We have our moisturizer system, our um, water gathering, our carpenters, our little chest area. There's a fermenter with uh, some biomass. Our squeezer doing some apple juice, our wheat farm, and our tree farm. So, um, biomass is good and all, but it's not very efficient. It's basically oil. Um, so instead of going straight to fuel, f what forestry has is kind of its own version of coal, except it works a lot better than coal, and that is called peat. Um, so there's a farm to make peat, it's called a peat farm, and um, just like the tree farm uses hummus, the peat farm is going to use something called bog earth. So I was in creative for flying. So if I look up bog earth, this is what it looks like, and there's a peat bog right next to it. So bog earth can be made in a carpenter, much like hummus can. It can also be made in a um, crafting table with these recipes, but I'm going to use the carpenter. So I'm going to get myself a carpenter, and I'm going to get myself, I already, I already have a biomass engine, uh, biomass engine, yeah. So I think I'm going to set my carpenter right here, looks good. Um, I installed inventory tweaks, it just makes things so much easier. Um, Direwolf has a good spotlight on that if you want to see it. So I'm going to give it some water, that'll be good. Um, I want to get an engine underneath it, so let's dig underneath and put an engine. <coughs> Excuse me. put some biomass and some lava. Now I'll start going. Alright, so next we're going to need our crafting pipe, which I thought I had. Did I stick it in a chest by accident? I'm just out. There's the crafting logistics pipe. And we're going to put it right here. And whack it with our wrench. Well, we don't have anything to whack it with. So, to make um, bog earth in a carpenter, you're going to need some dirt, which we have. Some sand. We'll just grab a bunch of that. And some mulch, which our moisturizer and our juicer over there are both making for us. So if you take four sand, four dirt, and one piece of mulch, that'll make eight bog earth. Pretty neat. So, I'm just gonna make this one, put another one in. Yeah, if you um, click the product, in a carpenter. It'll make it even if you don't have um, more than one set up, which is good to know. So eight bog earth, four of those, four of those, and a mulch. Cool. Alright, so now we have a way to get bog earth. Pretty cool. So how do you make a bog farm? Uh, peat bog. So how you make a peat bog is you get a sturdy machine and surround it with four pieces of copper and four pieces of glass. So I'm just gonna get one of those now. And let's see, where do I want to put this? 
I think I'm gonna put it over this way. So let's see. Um, I think right there will be good. Good, you know, good distance away. Um, and then to harvest the peat, I'm gonna need something called a turberry. It's four pieces of clay, a sturdy machine, four pieces of glass. So now I got one of those. So I'm gonna put that here. Cool. All right. We're gonna dig underneath so we can set up some engines. And we'll do one lava can, some biomass, one lava can, some biomass, and we will get some bog earth. And what's cool is, as you can see, the uh, peat bog will output dirt, so it's a way for us to get dirt. Alright, that should be good. So as you can see, it's starting to plant, and I'm going to pause the video and let it plant and uh, get back with you. Alright, so that's about done, um, and while that's finishing, you can see it, um, I'm going to set up the pipes that we'll need. So we're going to need a supplier pipe. Um, I think right there, and we're gonna keep stocked, um, uh, let's see, 32 bug earth? Yeah, sounds good. Alright, and from this one we're gonna have a basic logistics, because stuff will just come out. Um, And, um, I think I changed my mind on this. Instead of doing like that, I think I'm going to do top, and then this one here, and then, um, the dirt actually comes out of this one. So we're going to want one in front, and then a logistics pipe connecting them. Looks good. And we're going to want to whack this guy and tell him about the bog earth again. Cool. And then we can just run our pipes over. put a logistics pipe right there. And yep, everything going that way. And Bogarth's going out. Cool, cool. Alright, cool. So this guy just got filled up with more Bogarth. Nice. Alright. So that's working. Um so I'm actually going to cut the video from here and um, I'll start it up again when I see the first piece of peat come out. So hopefully that'll be soon. And there it comes. Peat. And I put this logistics pipe here to help speed it up a little. But glorious peat and oh, our bogarth going out. So we have peat and dirt. All right. Now at the farm, we had this um, biomass actually pumping into it to keep it supplied. So we're going to want to make sure that that doesn't get wasted. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back here, turn this off, reverse it, and turn it back on. You see, seed um, biomass actually starts going back in. 
So I'm gonna, um, I've already done the squeezer, the fermenter, I've already done everything else. So I'm gonna wait for this to come back a little. All right, so it's gone as low as it'll get, I think, without turning off these machines. So I'm just gonna lose a little bit. It's okay, I'll manage. And replace these. And just break all these. And I won't worry about this, I'll just go with dirt. And turn off the rain. And I think what I want to do is I'm going to go right here and break that. No, not that one. I'll break this one like that and go out, out, down, down, over, over. And then do a basic, and I'll dig down, and do stone, supplier, supplier. Cool. And do my peat. And it should be coming. Cool. Cool. Alright. Now I will do the same over here. I think I'll just dig under here. I think I'm just going to clean off this tubing, so I'll be right back. Alright, pipes all cleaned up. So, um, one other thing I wanted to do in this episode was um, make a melon and cactus farm. So if I look up the recipe, and basically how these work is um, they don't plant anything, but they'll harvest. So both of them harvest in an area 21 by 21 and 13 high. So the recipe for a cactus harvest is four pieces of cactus around a logger with four pieces of glass. So we'll get one of those. And the recipe for a sugar cane is same except sugar cane. Pretty easy. Get one of those. All right. So how do I want this um, farm to go? Well, I don't want it interfering here. So I think what I'll do is I'll have one space, and then uh, starting here, I'm gonna count off 21 this way and see where I end up. So this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Huh? That was good, that's good. One, two, three, four, five, 14, 15, 16. Cool. That's 21 by 21. Um, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna count so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Get my uh, two farms. And then this one I'm going to put here. And this one I'm going to put here. So that side's going to be cactus, and this side is going to be sugarcane. All right, so I need a way to get 
this stuff out. So I'm just going to put a basic logistics pipe. Here and here. I think that can be regular. And I need my engines underneath, so I will do that. So engine. Our supplier pipe to be right here, and I guess I put the P away. One, two, three, four, five, and we're going to do the same thing over here. So torch. engine, supplier pipe, dirt, and click five. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. All right, so we need these connected, so I think I'm just going to take out this one, connect the two, and connect up. I'm just going to make this all logistics and then going to run it this way let's see where we end up I'm going down. Out of stone pipes. Uh, oops, wrong one. Stone transport. So I think this will be good. We want to break this one, put our basic logistics. Cool. So, um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay out my cactus and um, sugar cane, and it's going to be pretty boring. So, I'm just going to cut the video and I'll catch up with you guys later. Alright, so our uh, cactus and cane farm is done, and basically, how this works is um, as soon as any of these hit. Um, three blocks high, the top one will be removed by the harvester and will go down into our chests. So um, I think that's a good wrapping up point for this episode, not to steal direwolf's line. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Um, so you know, we have what we had before, and then our new additions are cactus and reed farm, and our peat bog farm. So uh, everything looks pretty good, and I'll see you guys around. Bye.